Today I'm going to be doing a Betsy Johnson handbag haul. I purchased some of her novelty bags. Now, I'm going to say this at the very beginning because I always get these comments. With novelty bags, sometimes the practicality element of it flies out the window. Yes, these purses generally are small, so that means you have to downsize whatever you are going to bring with you for the duration of the time you're wearing the bag. But um, with novelty purses, it's really just about the look and adding to your collection. I still find these practical because I don't generally walk out with a lot of things unless I'm going to school or something. I'm going to start off with the first bag, which is my favorite, and it's the Shake Ice Cream Bag. So it is shaped like a vintage 1950s milkshake, and um, on one side it says birds cold, sweet, and frosty, and then on the other side it says strawberries and cream, malted milkshake. It also has a little straw. There's some um, styrofoam on the inside. I haven't taken it off yet, and I'm not sure I will. I think it gives it a nice shape to it. It's a circular purse and the strap is like a creamy white so I really like this one. It was definitely the one that caught my eye the most and all these bags are relatively new so they are still available on Betsy.com or on Amazon. This next purse is the lollipop bag. Now this is very similar to the apple pie bag except this one has a hanging piece to represent the stick of a lollipop. So it's really cute and this part right here does actually spin. So on the handle it says sticky and sweet and it has a big bow on it. So this one's really cute. It has a baby pink strap to it and it is a crossbody bag. Last but not least is the oven and stove. I keep messing this up and calling it a washing machine. For some reason I keep forgetting that it is in fact a stove and oven. So the stove is right there at the top and it's a mint green bag and then inside you could see either what is that? Is that that's not casserole right that's a little keychain portion of it is shaped like an oven mitt which i thought was cute detail and it has a black strap and this one can also be worn like a crossbody bag but i usually just keep them like this let me know if you want to see more videos like this i'll link some of my previous novelty bag items down below because i have an ice cream bag i have an apple pie bag i have a a fox bag my collection is still growing so We'll see. <laughs> Betsy Johnson just has a lot of these cute novelty bags. They have like pizzas and like wine bottles and hamburgers and little turtles and animals and it's really cute stuff. So um, I hope you guys enjoy. Don't forget to give this video a like and subscribe if you enjoyed this content and you want to see more of it. So until next time. Bye guys. Today I'm back with 3 minute reviews and I'm going to be reviewing the Too Faced Peanut Butter and Jelly Palette. This palette contains 9 eyeshadows um, with a mix of shimmery and matte shades. I love the formula on this palette a little bit more than the formula of the Sugar Pop palette from last year because these, these are a lot, just a lot more pigmented, a lot easier to blend with the exception of Jelly. Jelly's like this very...